In this video, I'll show you how to set up anchor links in WordPress quickly and easily in 2023. Here I have WordPress installed and I just have a test page here under pages, all pages, and we'll click on sample page here. So I just added a bunch of text on here with some different headers. And then there's a larger one here in H1. So what we're gonna do is create a link at the top and when we click on it, it'll jump all the way down to this part. So you can use this to link to different sections and you can do it multiple times on a single page if you need to. So we need to create some type of link. I'll just do a basic list here. So you could add multiple links if you want to different sections. And we'll say custom alert messages. And let's just go ahead and select all of this and add a link here. We'll click the link button. And to create an anchor tag or an anchor link, we have to start with a hashtag here or the pound symbol and then give it a custom name. So whatever makes sense. So for this one, we'll call it custom alert. Now, for example, if you're linking to a map section or something, you could call it map or shop or whatever. It's going to be on the same page, whatever that section is called. I'll just go ahead and hit enter on my keyboard and we can see that we set this up. Now, if we go ahead and click this, it's not going to do anything because it needs a place to go. So if we come down, we can say that we want it to scroll to this point here, this header. Let's select this. And on the right hand side in WordPress here, we have advanced. Let's open this up and you'll see HTML anchor. Now we want to give it the same name here without the hashtag. So we'll call it custom alert. And again, don't put the pound or the hashtag here. And let's go ahead and save this. We'll click update and I'll preview this page by going to preview and preview in new tab. So here we can see the page and we have our link right here. And if I go ahead and click on that, you can see that it jumps right down to the page where we had that anchor link added to this header and that's all there is to it so for example if you wanted to add another one for this section you would just follow the same steps with a separate or second link now of course adding anchor links to your website is simple to begin with but there's lots of other features that are a little bit more difficult and you might want to use a page builder for this we highly recommend using seed prod so i have seed prod set up here under the theme builder where i imported a website and i'm just going to take a look at the home page here and we're going to add a quick anchor link. So I built this website in minutes by importing one of our pre-made templates that come with Seedprod. Now let's say we want to add a anchor link here and bring it down all the way to our map. You just simply click on the button here and I'm just going to go ahead and rename this here under the button text and I'll rename this location. Seedprod makes it super easy to edit any element on your page and we'll change the link here to hashtag location. At the bottom, let's come down to the map here and we can actually go to the blocks here and we'll search for the anchor block. Here under advanced, we can just take the anchor block and drag it into our page wherever we want. And I'll hit the settings here and give it a name. We'll call this location. And I'll just go ahead and save this in preview. Now on the page here, when I click location, you can see that it jumps down to our map. Seedprod is the best page builder to be using in 2023. We have fantastic blocks here that you can use to create all sorts of websites to fully customize any type of personal, small business, or shop that you may need. For more information about Seedprod, please click the link in the description below or visit seedprod.com. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.